Okay, so it's a love poem, but it's like, that's, that's the entire like feeling I have when it comes to love poem. <laughs> Seriously, again? So it's my anti-love poem? I don't know. Ain't no sunshine when he's gone. It's true. But I'm not ready to love you. But like coffee to conversation, I'm taken. And I can't imagine breaking my soul apart from yours. Even though we have shared over 1,000 nights together. Even though we have talked about whether a, a house or a family would be better. I'm not ready to love you like you need. Passionately. Rationally turn to rationing, and I'm stuck in this island of a mind. Caution is the wind, and I watch you give me your windbreaker, where I am heartbreaker, where I wash my face with your tears, and I build my life on your back, and I wait until you crack. I'm scared I'll take the best years of your life and ruin you as I run by my own rules. If I stay with you, I will break your heart and wreck the family that we haven't even created yet. I'm stubborn, I'm reckless, I'm wretched. I worry that because I don't commit to your commitments anymore, that I don't fit into your life, our life, because I'm tired. I'm tired of the emotion that goes into it. I'm tired of not loving you like you need. I'm tired of not being loved like I need because it's too hard. But most of all, I'm not ready to love me and it kills me. I am so far behind understanding myself that at times when I'm close, it hurts. And it's these moments that I love with abandon, even though my heart is often stranded between two goalposts, constantly suspended, pre-point, and that game has ended. I often overpromise myself that I feel like everyone, and yet I feel like no one, and I can't begin to understand why you're with me. So I martyr myself. And I slay you in my friendly fire because I know my desire will not retire. I do this for you. It's for you. And I dread this end like, like I dread winter. On its first cold day and into the realization that there are seven long months of this and I forgot to turn on the heat. But on the other hand, if I sit here in the silence and I let the furnace stay off, at least I'll have something to complain about. Ain't no sunshine when he's gone.